Greeting, this is Ahmed with another Primavera P6 lesson. In this lesson, we want to talk about update progress series, but part two related to activity steps. Activity steps is very powerful tools in Primavera P6 designed to help us. But how? Why? Activity steps, we are not going to divide the activity to the smaller piece of work, so it helps us. We have easier update, and this is the good solution to break down complex activity during the project without, without provide more breakdown in our WBS. Also, we have limited logic in our relationship and also we have limited logic in our relationship because of that. But how activity steps work in our software? First of all, I want to talk about activity step setting. It's my project. My project have some activities. This is very simple project and how activity steps works. At the first you should select your project and go to calculation sheet and then check this button for the activity steps. Activity percent complete based on activity steps. You should check it and this dialog box appear and inform you to activity steps applied in your project. After that, I go through my project and select my activity which I want to change to activity steps. I want to change all of my engineering activity instead of management to the activity steps. So, I should change all percent complete type to the physical. Okay, I use the global change. And percent complete type change to physical. Wait for a moment. So I change the duration percent complete to the physical percent complete for all of my activity in engineering section. And I don't want to save a log. That's it. Okay. Now my activity is prepared to assign activity steps. But how you can assign activity steps into your activities? You should open uh, the detail window, which I opened it before, activity details, and go through steps and add. If you don't uh, prepare your step before, you should add each of your steps by your own. For, for instance, first issue Second issue, final or approval. This is the template for my steps. But if you want to assign some steps, 
into your all of your engineering, it's better for you to uh, make a activity and steps template before you start to assign your steps to your activities. I have three kind of uh, step template. Uh, I prepare them before. You can, if you uh, want to uh, add some, you can use this add button. And if you want to delete some of them, you can delete it. And it, this is your step weight. I enter my progress for each step as a step weight. But I come back to my activity, delete my previous steps. And I want to assign my sample webinar steps to my activities. It's very fast for me to assign all the steps with activity steps template to my activities. As you see, I assign to all of my engineering activity activity steps. But how you can update it? First of all, you should select the status tabs and go to restart and use this start in order to actual start for the activity. Then go through your steps and for instance, this activity, pass the steps one. If after I use these steps completed, let me to okay, that's good. After I completed the steps one, you can find my activity percent complete and my physical percent complete updated by software. If I push the second one, it's going to be 18%. 16% and 20% cumulative is 18%. This is all you need to know about your activity steps. Things more if you can have your several setting in your project. For instance, my engineering updated by activity step setting, but my procurement have a different setting my procurement is a unit base and physical percent complete type is unit and i have not any steps for my procurement activities so do not worry if you like to use activity steps use it it's very helpful I hope this lesson would be useful for you. Please keep in touch with my LinkedIn, YouTube, and Instagram for further lesson. Also, you can follow my hashtag Global Project Control in order to find all of my lesson in the same page. Thank you for your subscription 
in my channel.